my gosh, y'all are messing up my vlog. Hey guys, so on this episode of Attentional Bonus Mom, oh, why do I always say that? Um, today on Stepmom Talk, I wanted to talk about something that means a lot to me that's meant something to me for a long time. So, I've been to weddings. I've been to a lot of weddings where there were, well, I shouldn't say a lot of weddings, but I've been to weddings where there were stepkids and I've been to weddings where they were just the couple getting married and eventually going to have kids. Um, and so, I've seen different types of weddings and I have read about weddings and watched videos of weddings just to kind of get an idea of like how does everybody else do this and so today I wanted to talk about as we narrow down closer to October 22nd how do I how am I doing one specific part of that and one of those are the vows now I have been a girl that has always dreamed about my husband writing vows to me just like I have always dreamed about writing vows to my husband and depending on his personality and who he is how those vows would go and so as a amateur writer like who dreams of becoming making it big off writing books I've written that scene a million and a half times for the different characters as they embark on one of the biggest life-changing moments in their life and so, in each story, um, I will be completely honest, they never did vows to the kids, or there weren't even kids there, so what vows would you write to a child? So, what do I do now? Okay, I love my life. I never said that I was never going to be a stepmom. I kind of looked at it with, like, 2020 vision if, that I don't have, but, and I kind of looked at it like... Hey, honestly, the statistics and stuff, I'm probably going to marry somebody with kids. And look what's happening. <coughs> so, with that said, I knew that when it came to dating and meeting somebody and being open-minded to being a stepmom, I also had to be open to what are we going to do? There's little things that happen in your life that you kind of question. And one of those big things were whenever I get married I've always dreamed about writing vows to my husband so why would I not write vows to the kids and so everybody has a different look on this sometimes they just say something little or something big and so I've started to write my vows working on my vows writing little things that I want to put in there little notes and stuff and one of the big things is to write vows to my kids because I feel like you know what we're I did not just marry I'm not just marrying a man, I'm marrying his family. And so that's always been a really, really big thing to me. And a huge undertaking um, because it's like, what do you say? And it's not even that there's going to be so many people there. I don't even care about everybody else being there. This is us. This is uniting us as a family. So I kind of just making this video and wanting to say, you know, I'm including my kids. I want them to be a part of the ceremony. They're going to have a special place in the ceremony. Um, I don't know what the title is. may not even be a title, but they're going to have their special place. Um, because I'm not just marrying the man of my dreams. I'm marrying a family. And so, with that said, how many of you stepmoms um, wrote vows to your kids? Maybe you didn't write vows to your kids. Um... Was there something special you did in the ceremony to kind of include you, include them, include everybody as you were blending as a family? Are you one of those ones that weren't able to have your stepkids there because of conflicts with mom, um, conflicts with scheduling? Like, how do you do that? And did you do something different with the kids to kind of um, unite you as a family? For us, um, I will be saying vows to them, and then we will do a sand ceremony where we will all put sand in to um, a little container just uniting us as a family and making that unity so 
those are the ideas that I have. Those are what I feel like I really want to do. So I just kind of wanted to kind of get your opinion on it. I don't think it's going to really change mine, but maybe add to it. Like, oh, I really like. So anyway, just wanted to know. Um, I know everybody's different. And I just kind of want to get some opinions because maybe what I'm doing, I could alter it a little bit. But I definitely know I'm still going to do the same ceremony. I'm still going to do... Um, write vows to them but there might be something else that we can add in there so please let me know what you guys did and thanks for watching